Hey guys, it's Rebellion here, and welcome back to From the Depths. Now, it has been a very, very, very long time since I have done anything remotely in From the Depths. Or, really, anything in From the Depths. I haven't touched it in a long, long while. Which is sad, but I just fell out of love with the game. But now I've decided to uh, come and give it a try. And today I'm going to build like a small destroyer. Um, oh, come on, what's the, uh, what's the controls? Um, okay. So I'm just going to build like this small kind of starting ship just ready for the campaign which I'm going to uh, get back into. I need to turn mirror mode on. It's N. There we go. Oh my god this thing's so choppy. Yeah, I need to use caps lock. So yeah, this thing's not going to be very well armoured, very well anything really, it's just to start off the campaign. Probably going to go through a lot of iterations. I'm going to start building it forward so I don't actually hit. Now, I've remembered a lot of people wanted me to use the mouse and keyboard building mode, so that is pretty much exactly what I'm going to do as best as I can. Okay, so this is the basic shape of the ship. I uh, don't know how deep I'm going to make it. Let's take it down to here for now. Probably going to have APS cannons. Don't know what ammo they're going to use at the moment. They're only going to be small. Oh, I could just use fill mode. It has been, as I say, so long since I've even touch this game that real realistically I'm just starting from new So yeah, if there's anything that you want me to attempt to build, or anything that will actually help me learn to build, then just let me know, because I will definitely be uh, trying to learn as much as I can. Let's just do that for now. You'll probably be switching between them a lot, for the simple reason of it. Damn it. Because it just makes it easier for me. I try and use mouse and keyboard as much as I can, but let's just go to let's just go three. I'm definitely gonna be trying to learn to use on more of these because like I say it's been so long. Let's leave it on a two. More forward. Okay, that's interesting. I haven't seen that yet. Look at the slopes. Go down to a two. This is generally just my building style. Is the chair's gonna go. Oh, they now have elevated chairs, do they? There we go. Now I'm not just sat at the bottom of the ocean. They should finish things. Oh, 
rudder. And just two propellers there. Let's get rid of that actually. And there we go. Please don't clip that. Thank you. Need an air pump. Oh yeah, I made a mistake. I lied. There's lead. Wow. Okay, they added a lot of lead. Like I say, it's been a nice long while. Eventually this will just get replaced with alloy and other things. Does that help? That sits really high on the water. Let's use this to move quicker. Like that. There we go now. We don't sit too high in the water. This thing's going to be slow. As anything I've just realised. Okay, so now that it floats, it is watertight. We'll be adding compartments. Yeah, okay, those work. Let's have some two meter beams. Have some. Okay, there's more glass options now as well. So we will have three minute glass, three minute glass, three minute glass that side. Wonder, wonder. Like I say, this is going to be an awful looking superstructure, but you get what you get, essentially. <laughs> Not con- oh. I need an AI. <laughs> Oh dear, okay, so, AI, weapon control. Was... Oh, they have built-in wireless receivers now? Oh, that's so nice. So I need to add is a fail safe. OK, 
Okay, so these are really, really nice. Then let's just go down to the fail safe. It will be poking through. Essentially, if this thing gets hit, it's not going to go well. But, and again, as a small destroyer. Now I need to remove this one. Okay, so this seems to be going better now that we have some other stuff. It lets me build better as well. Oh, there's torpedoes actually I can add. Let's try 40. Oh my god, this looks atrocious. Oh. And then we will have a door here. can have a ladder going up there. We can probably have some other stuff in here, but this thing's growing larger and larger by the second. For me, you're there, for me, you're there. Three me, you're there. And then something from here. We need some detection systems, and those will be in control. Although I do need a uh, ship's wheel. These things are absolutely huge. Let's put it down there. I wish that there was a smaller one. But apparently this there hasn't been added, so Looks like I'm using the big ones. Need a hatch. And decorations, I'm guessing. <clears throat> and then I also need ladders. Okay, and then there's ladders going up. And then... 
I'm actually just going to remove that. I'm only going to have one. Then I will have a funnel. So I'm going to need ammo. So that's my ammo. Batteries and everything. Then I'm also going to need a Lance Cannon, I need ammo, customizer. Need gunpowder casings, yes. I don't know if I want them to fire high explosive or armor piercing. Could go hollow point armor piercing. Hollow point high explosive. I need to be kinetic, so I need So, let's make this nasty. Hollow point solid. Yeah. Shoot. Actually, no. We'll just we'll just go with solid. It's like this. What size are these guns? 90. Okay, so this is going to be a 94 millimeter gun. Processor. I need material storage. So that's actually I'm going to add a little couple more. I also need an ammunition. Have they got rid of it? Have they got rid of ammo processors? Probably.
Let's do it like this. Just. And here we have it. <laughs> oh dear lord. How fast does this thing go? Oh dear lord, it's so slow. I'm about to turn it. I'm actually scared to see it turn. Not bad. This thing is rather low in the water. Which I don't mind. chair that won't leave me so high up okay this thing's a little bit too low in the water now that I've had added all of the uh, stuff in it let's try that Question is how stable is this? In these waves, I think the correct answer is no. But like if we went broadside onto this wave, we get tossed about. Okay. I'm actually happy with that. I have no vehicles anymore. Now, I know other people could make an absolutely beautiful masterpiece that can defeat the campaign from the start, but I cannot do that. Listening. Controls your moving out. So it's too thin. That's what I'm thinking. I'm probably I, I need to make it wider. And then let's spawn. Spawn Jacob's Folly. At least it's work. Oh, yeah. Synchronize with one. Then you. Synchronize with three, because that one's two. One a thousand meters.
has the sound as well. Torpedoes are too deep. How much does this thing actually cost? 25,000 materials? I thought this thing was going to be cheaper. That was a big hit. What the hell hit? None of processing power. Okay, that's, that's fine. So let's just do that. Nice. Okay. So. Okay, so this thing turns. Oh my god. And back. Okay, so this is going to be it for this episode. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. It's been a pleasure playing this again, surprisingly. And I hope to see you in the next one.